I just started my day and I've already run into a problem. We're Steph and Micah and we're converting an ambulance into a camper van. This week, we're moving on to the next stage. Wait! <laughs> But first, we need to finish building out this kitchen. As usual, we had our fair share of troubleshooting. Oh, shoot. But it was well worth the effort because the results are magical. Ah, uh, fuck it out! Abracadabra. <laughs> Crazy things coming up. Let's get ready to rumble. The plan today is we're gonna get the face of this cabinet on here. Well, first off, what we're gonna try to do is make this all out of one piece. So it's just flush and flat and modern. So we're just gonna cut the full width and height of this, dry fit it on there, and then get our measurements for our doors and drawers and cut those out. And we'll see if we cut it perfect enough to be able to use those cutouts as the drawer faces. Ah, uh, bracadabra! Abracadabra? <laughs> abracadabra! Like that? En français, ah, uh, bracadabra! I'm so sorry, honey. Oh, he's mad. <laughs> we got one shot to get this right. Here we go. So we got all of our cabinet faces cut. I'm kind of waiting to put them up because I need the cabinet hinges. I'm just stowing those all away for right now. Good morning everybody. Just started my day and I've already run into a problem. I was about to work on the cabinets here. Most people do three quarter inch because the hinges are recessed a half an inch. And to do this, you need a Forstner bit. But I did the faces with half an inch. So if I did a half an inch recess, then there would be a hole. So what I gotta do is put quarter inch on the back side of those pieces and then glue it and I'll come back tomorrow and drill these in there and try and get them on the cabinet. So not fun, but I'm glad I came up with a solution rather than going and starting from scratch. So that's what we're doing now. Now that we've got this all glued, we're going to start building the drawers. You like a little construction doggy, aren't you? Stuff has been gone. I think she's been really affectionate. I love you, but stay out there. Oh. So I'm building the drawers. I got all the pieces cut out. So now I'm gonna put them together, drill them together, and then we're gonna put those in. And once we put the drawers in, I think we're gonna be done.
Moment of truth. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. That looks good. Now we're cooking. Very nice. I think I'm done for today. I'm gonna save the faces of that for later. But it was pretty good. See y'all tomorrow. Good morning, Byron. So we got a couple updates. Yeah, we got a couple updates. <laughs> I was gone in Canada to visit my nephew. My sister just gave birth, so I just went for, for about six days. And Micah was here working on the ambulance, so yeah, so I'll show you. You're still wearing the same thing though. Always wearing this. That's Me my too. only work clothes. <laughs> Me too. Wow, look at that. Doesn't that look so cool? So we finished this whole situation right here. And this one. We got these push latch so that when we're driving around it's not Good. flying everywhere so now you can open it and you can leave it like that but then when you're driving just push it this is our very shallow cabinet yeah so we'll be putting spices and rice and whatever in there but i mean it's still storage one thing that happened don't is, point it out you don't need to point it out i'm gonna point it out <laughs> okay people guess what is wrong i'm not gonna tell you guys just guess what is wrong with this. And we'll give a... High five. High five <laughs> to the person. But we were very upset when it happened, but just guess what's wrong. But then this is the pantry. So we have like a lot of space actually. They're pretty deep. And he also fixed this thing cause he didn't like the way it looked before. It looked stupid before. So this is like the trash area. So it has the same thing and then we have to put like some kind of well we're gonna put piano hinge and then a, a chain right here so it stays up but the trash is gonna be in there but yeah pretty happy about that this is another piano hinge that's gonna go like this i'm gonna go like that and then we'll put shoe storage and other stuff here and i think that's pretty much it uh yeah today we are getting ready to Paint! <laughs> right, do you like it? Good. So this is just the primer, but this gives you an idea of what's going on. Right, that's it for today. We might see you guys tomorrow. Bye! This is the real white color. It's like off-white, I guess. Looking good. Okay, bye. <laughs> Since Steph is painting, I'm going to start putting together the upper cabinets over the kitchen area. painting all morning the inside because we did a primer coat of the white and then we did a coat of just like white <laughs> like off-white kind of and yesterday and then we thought I thought that I just would need to go up and just do a couple touch-ups but we kind of needed like a third coat so I did that this morning but now I'm gonna be painting um, the garage area black yeah I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna bring you along I only have this to stir it. <laughs> Let's go paint. I'm listening to an audiobook while painting and I don't know if I like them. It's kind of weird like listening to someone reading you a book, but I love reading books, so I wanted to give it a try. But do you guys like audiobooks? I need to know. And if you do, which ones do you recommend? Thank you. 
taking this painting out there. I'm done with this box. And this box. Hey guys. I've been inside editing all day. But I just wanted to give a little shout out to Steph. Look at her. <laughs> She's playing contortionist over here. I'm almost done. I just have this little that little bit. That was satisfying. <laughs> and then the next step is to do the polyurethane. I thought Micah was saying polyurethane. Polyurethane, but it's polyurethane. <laughs> so anyways, we have to put that on all of the plywood or something. What's up guys? So, I've been building, but I haven't been filming, so don't hate me. We've just been kind of doing monotonous things like painting, finishing touches and stuff, but I did start hanging some upper cabinets, so I do want to show you that. We're back at it. Okay, so look at this. Cabinet is pretty much done. We put a coat, you probably can't even see it, but it's really smooth. There's a coat of water-based polyurethane on this plywood. And that's the upper cabinet. So I don't have the face on it yet, but it's in there. And I'll say it is solid. It ain't going nowhere. Next, this is our little closet. And it is a lot shallower than I anticipated. But I don't know if I showed you all the corners are caulked and they look finished, except for this stupid little thing that I regret doing. Oh, and don't forget the fridge. The fridge is in. And it's a large fridge for a camper. We got that from Rec Pro. And I like the size and the price. Much better than spending two grand on a 12 volt fridge. Okay, now this is the hard part. I didn't film myself struggling on the other one, but uh, I was I was struggling to say the least. Probably because I wasn't doing it right. So let's see. That, that's gonna fit nicely. Very nice. Very happy. Good morning, everybody. It's another beautiful day. The sun is shining. It's bright as. But we gotta get a few things done today. Of course, we gotta get a few things done today. regular tip if you're wearing a hoodie while you're doing construction like working around saws and stuff take these drawstrings do yourself a favor and just tuck them in I don't know it would probably rip off and I'd be fine but I don't want to find out now it's time to cut some holes Hello. Now is the time to cut this dog food opener box thing. Full send. Hello, everybody. 
everybody. So we've been working on the ambulance for the past probably five days and we haven't filmed anything. And that's because we um, ran out of space on our cards and our hard drive. So we had to figure all of that out and that took forever. And then we've been just doing like little details in the ambulance, which are less interesting, but we will update you now on what we did in the past five days. Let's go. Okay, now let's start right here. So this is the trash can. So yesterday Micah put these on so it can open up like this and this little chain so it doesn't hit the ground. Super smart because a lot of people in vans don't think about where to put, it, put their trash can. So we thought about that. And then here is where we put our shoes. Very smart too. We cut a little hole here and we're gonna put another knob there and it'll open like this. And right here is gonna be where we put Byron's food and all of his accessories. We still have to put the knobs, but look at this. Like that's a lot of space for... No, it's not. <laughs> it is for a van. And then still need to put a knob, but we did this little chute and this is our, gonna be our dirty laundry. Oh, and this thing. Oh yeah, we did the little niche here, as you remember, there Finally. was like a hole, and Micah wasn't sure what to do with it, but he did this a couple days ago, and it's really cool. I think it turned out really good. I, I honestly was kind of scared that it would turn out ugly, but I think it's kind of cool. Yeah, so we put like an outlet box here, and then this is to switch on and off the inverter. Correct. Oh, come outside. So we put this plywood right here just to hide like the bed frame, and I think it looks really good. But he didn't tell the story of how it was before. Yeah, so Micah put it on and it was like this It was originally big. that big. And we closed the door and we couldn't open it because it was like right there. And we we're like, oh shoot. So he had to like cut it while the door was closed or something. I don't really know. Yeah, I booby trapped it shut yeah. on accident. So anyways, that's all the updates for now. Um, so we're going to end the video here. But come back next week because we have some crazy things coming up. Bye guys! Woohoo! Good morning everybody! Today is an exciting day because I'm putting together the electrical. Oh my gosh, I'm like scared it's gonna catch on fire. <laughs> Too a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Whoa! It works! Anybody can figure this out. You can do it.